This is a 78-year-old male who presented for chronic headaches and fatigue. The images demonstrate numerous T2 flare, minimally hyperintense, rounded soft tissue lesions involving the bilateral temporal fossa, masticator, parapharyngeal, and parotid spaces. There is also involvement of the orbital extraconal fat and extraocular muscles best demonstrated on the diffusion weighted images and ADC maps. In addition, the ADC maps better demonstrate the degree of masticator and parotid space involvement. In retrospect, there is abnormal T2 flare hyperintense signal within the medial rectus muscle on the left as well as within the pterygoid muscle complex on the left. The involvement of these muscle complexes is best demonstrated on the diffusion weighted, in, diffusion weighted images and ADC maps. There is also involvement of the enlarged left adenoid. The imaging findings are suggestive of an infiltrating hypercellular tumor. The main differential is lymphoma versus metastatic disease. This is the case of biopsy-proven chronic lymphocytic leukemia. Chronic lymphocytic leukemia is the most common type of leukemia to affect elderly adults. The American Cancer Society reports that there will be about 15,720 new cases of chronic lymphocytic leukemia in 2014, with CLL accounting for approximately one-third of all new cases. The average person's lifetime risk of getting CLL is about 1 in 200, with men having a slightly higher risk than women.